This just in, Elon Musk officially unveils Tesla's electric plane. Elon Musk, CEO of Tesla, has been discussing the possibility of electric airplanes, which he believes will be viable in about five years. Could Musk be working on a Tesla plane? We are already seeing electric airplane programs. How realistic is this? Let's check it out. Welcome to our channel, where you get real updates about space and technologies. In today's video, we are discussing how Elon Musk officially unveils Tesla's electric plan. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button and also smash the bell icon so that you can be notified when we release a new video. Kindly stay tuned to the end of this video as we level these questions one after the other. Thanks. Tesla and Elon Musk were instrumental in revolutionizing the automotive industry by demonstrating that electric vehicles were both practicable and commercially viable. Tesla and Musk are now looking to the skies where they have the potential to revolutionize aviation in the same way they have. Tesla CEO Elon Musk has had a long-term goal of building an electric airplane. Tesla's electric plane details have been revealed recently by him. Tesla's electric plane will require increased battery density. Musk was asked about Tesla's plans for an electric airplane at Tesla's annual shareholder meeting, according to CNET. His response was both encouraging and discouraging. According to him, battery density improves every year. On the other hand, high battery density is a major obstacle in the development of electric aircraft. When it comes to long distance flights, an electric plane requires a more powerful battery to allow it to take off and fly. The battery density of a Tesla Model 3 is 250 watts per kilo. A 400 watt per kilogram battery density was previously stated by Tesla CEO Elon Musk. The ideal weight to capacity ratio is 500 watt hours per kilogram. Musk also believes that Tesla will eventually reach a density of 400 watt hours per kilogram. When can we expect an electric plane from Tesla? Disappointingly for Tesla fans, Musk's response indicates that the company has no immediate plans to build an electric airplane. Elon Musk quipped, We've got a lot going on right now. That's both accurate and overstated. He's known for being a prolific project manager and entrepreneur. In addition to increasing the production of the current models, Tesla is working on delivering the first Cybertrucks to customers. Musk is also working on the Hyperloop and SpaceX. Tesla CEO Elon Musk said, We had quite a few fish to fry here, so maybe one day we'll get around to building the electric plane. Tesla CEO Elon Musk said, It would be a fun problem to work on at some point, but we have a lot to do over the next few years, so we've got to focus on these things. Then maybe one day, you can do that if you get them right. In what form might a Tesla-powered plane take flight? There are a few Tesla vehicles that can match the beauty and elegance of the Cybertruck despite its stellar performance. What might a Tesla electric airplane look like in light of this information? According to a 2015 interview with Inverse, Elon Musk said he had a design in mind for Tesla. He didn't provide any additional information, however. Earlier this year, someone shared the concept art of a Tesla electric plane that resembled a manta ray. Musk said, I think it's a really good idea. The electric plane has long been a dream of Musk. I've got an idea for an electric jet, said Tesla CEO Elon Musk in a cameo appearance in Iron Man 2. Tesla's electric jets could take a long time to fly. However, as the battery density issue must be solved as well as other pressing issues. Three to four years, according to Elon Musk, is the time frame given for an important piece of technology. Don't forget to smash the like and subscribe button. Thanks. On Monday, Tesla CEO Elon Musk said an electric jet could be ready in three to four years, and the company could soon reveal more advancements in the field. The futuristic zero emissions jet would require a battery pack with a density of 400 watt hours per kilogram, Musk said in response to a Twitter thread about its potential. In order for this battery to be more than just a one-off, it would have to be mass produced. In a tweet, Tesla CEO Elon Musk said this breakthrough is probably three to four years away. Tesla's battery day plans have been publicized since then. At 1.30 p.m. Pacific time on September 22nd, the company's annual shareholder meeting will conclude with this special event. The main event motif looks like exotic battery technology called silicon nanowires, as reported on Monday by the website Electric. With improved batteries, an electric plane became more feasible in 2008, and four years later, he claimed to have an idea of what it would look like. Even during his cameo appearance in Iron Man 2 in 2010, Musk mentioned the idea. 
Tesla CEO Elon Musk said in an interview in 2016 that the plane would fly and land vertically. Battery density, or the amount of energy a kilogram of the battery can hold, is the main roadblock. That's critical for flight, as a plane must overcome the gravitational pull of the Earth in order to take off. There is no need for a large reserve of power for the plane's return because the plane can rely on the gravitational potential energy generated during its descent, so it doesn't need a large bank of reserve energy. The initial takeoff phase is the most difficult, and density is critical. Tesla CEO Elon Musk claimed in 2018 that current electric car batteries have a capacity of around 250 watt-hours per kilogram. A Tesla Model 3's additional range would be cut only by 15 miles if its 150 kilogram, 330 pound, of weight were removed, according to ARK Invest analyst Sam Kors. However, improvements in battery density for the electric jet could make the vehicle significantly more useful. It's possible the battery day will help us get there. In a post, course revealed that Amprius, a battery technology company, is located near Tesla's Fremont headquarters. That 400 watt hour per kilogram mark is a claim by Amprius, which uses 100% silicon nanowire batteries, the same technology as Tesla's battery day site. Aerial transportation is a long way down the priority list for Tesla at the moment. In a 2018 interview, Musk claimed that the electric plane isn't necessarily right now in light of the growing popularity of electric vehicles. Even though electric jets are important, they aren't as important as electrifying ground-based transportation. Despite accounting for 24% of the world's carbon dioxide emissions in 2016, road-based transportation accounted for 72% of those emissions, the World Resources Institute found. Electric aircraft may be a possibility in the future if battery technology advances and it becomes feasible to electrify a jet. Telecom's chief technology officer for aerospace and defense told Inverse in July 2019 that the battery would be the first obstacle to overcome before dealing with voltage and regulatory issues, as predicted by Marin Martinod. An electric airliner could take to the skies as early as 2040 if batteries are available. However, Tesla's battery event could be the first step towards a brighter future for electric vehicles. When Elon Musk isn't slaving away at Tesla, SpaceX, SolarCity, or one of his many other businesses, it appears he's mulling over the idea of an electric plane. Tesla CEO Elon Musk told comedian and UFC analyst Joe Rogan on his podcast, The Joe Rogan Experience, that he wanted to build an electric vertical takeoff and landing supersonic jet. Rather than using a runway, Musk's plane would lift itself into the air before taking off. Tesla CEO Elon Musk explained, The trick is to transition to level flight. For vertical takeoff and landing, you'll need something that's not capable of high-speed flight. I've given this a lot of thought. In other words, the electric plane design proposed by Tesla CEO Elon Musk has several roadblocks before it can become a reality. Perhaps the biggest stumbling block is Tesla CEO Elon Musk. Musk told Rogan, The electric airplane isn't necessarily right now. An electric car is a necessity. The use of solar energy is critical. The importance of long-term energy storage cannot be overstated. Creating a supersonic electric VTOL isn't nearly as important as other issues. The shift away from carbon-based sources of energy like oil to a more sustainable form of energy, despite his admiration for the concept of an electric plane, he emphasized the importance of renewable energy in the form of electric cars and solar power, rather than focusing on the technology itself. Asked about the global use of fossil fuels, Musk said, It's crazy that we're extracting vast amounts of carbon from deep underground and putting it into the atmosphere. We should not go ahead and do this. I don't recommend it at all. We should hasten the shift to renewable energy sources. Fans of electric planes should be sorry to hear that it appears that Elon Musk's exciting idea will remain just that, an exciting idea. However, Musk's focus on renewable energy appears to be of greater benefit to the environment. Did you think the idea of the electric plane is amazing? Kindly comment down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel and also hit the bell icon so that you can be notified when we release a new video. Thanks.